In this extra credit experiment, the conditions for this experiment were that the water needs to be purified and kept very still during the procedure until the supercooling effect has occurred. The variables being tested were the condition and states of the water in which the water bottle was kept. The procedure that took place during this experiment is first buying and acquiring a Fiji or purified water bottle, then placing it properly into a freezer, making sure that it does not move at all until after approximately two hours when the water bottle has officially become super cooled. And then you can level it with a solid surface and without hitting it. And then finally, when you are ready, bang it on the surface and observe the super cooling effect. The sample preparation for this experiment requires three things. One, a bottle of Fiji water. Two, a freezer set at medium temperature and three, a hard surface. Water cannot contain impurities, which is why Fiji water is used, because the impurities in water can cause the particles in the liquid to which the water molecules are attracted to that can form a crystal which attracts more molecules, and hence the liquid then freezes. Some background about this experiment is that supercooling is a very cool scientific process where there is a certain state in which liquids do not quite solidify even though they are well below their freezing point temperatures. The freezing of water requires a very ordered arrangement of molecules in which the molecules are not in until after the water bottle is banged on the counter or the molecules in the water are disturbed in some way. The scientific supercooled state that the molecules are in when the molecules are disordered and halted. For the ice to form, as you saw in this video, the molecules need some kind of force to be able to rearrange themselves into a more ordered state than they were before. This energy or force that comes in this project is from shaking or banging the water bottle or disturbing the liquid molecules in some way. As you can see as this process is repeated that the procedure follows as taking a Fiji water bottle out of the freezer when it has been approximately two hours and just checking on the water bottle to see when the supercooling has officially occurred and then banging it on the table and you can see how the crystallized and water molecules have formed showing the supercooling effect. For clarity, I am going to the sink and showing that what was originally liquid water from the freezer has now turned into ice particles in the water bottle. And this is the supercooling effect.